Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Mike Creates. It's been about three weeks or nearly a month, and I truly do apologize for not uploading sooner, but here's the reason why. Oh, before I continue, I need to look a little bit more presentable. Now that I'm a little more dressed up, today I'm going to be going to the gallery and commissioning some of my artwork for the first time here in Colorado. And before I do that and take you guys along, I'm going to just show you some of the artwork that I've been doing over the past three weeks in which I haven't been posting on YouTube. So let's go do that. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you've probably already seen all these artworks. If you're not following me, um, you can follow me down. I'll put the link down below and i also pop it up on the screen up here will tip was the first piece that i did within these last three weeks of not being here on youtube and the basic meaning behind it is it was inspired by robert frost nothing gold can stay and that's her body which acts as a stem to all the beautiful plants that once were in her growing out of her head they're now decayed and wilted and I just wanted to take a sense of giving this piece more of an emotion than more of a meaning, which is what I did with my other two pieces as well. I wanted to just create more of a death, depressed, decaying thing. Gentle Beast. This piece was extremely extraordinary. It allowed me to express color in my images now, which I haven't done in quite some time. With this drawing, I wanted to create or simulate a beast that would be at a calm, peaceful state, showing that she is at rest. By doing this, I just created the light. I drew a lady and I added horns onto her, and I put her in more of a peaceful state with nice, long, white cloth wrapped around her body. I added the butterflies to represent her soul at peace. Last but not least, the final drawing that I did for the gallery is a drawing named Forgiveness. When creating this piece and developing this piece, I had no train of thought of what I wanted to do or anything. I just wanted to get something on the paper and have it look good. Um, so the meaning of this piece didn't really come when it created this piece, but yet I was able to create a meaning behind the piece once I finished the piece. I wanted to go back with the butterflies and I wanted to create more so of a butterfly series, which is why this one has the three butterflies and the other gentle beast drawing also has three butterflies. When looking at this piece um, afterwards, I knew that this character seemed to be tired. That's why I named it Forgiveness. I seen the character as a way of asking for forgiveness and asking for mercy because it is tired and it's just ready to rest. I put the butterflies as the same reason again, showing the state of the soul being at rest, being finally able to be at peace. Um, I want you guys to comment down below and let me know what you guys think about these drawings. Which one is your favorite? What do they mean to you? Alright guys, got my art right here. Let's go ahead and head to the gallery. Alright, we're in the car. Alright guys, we have arrived at the gallery, about to go inside and hang some artwork. That's going to be the gallery right there.
Hey guys, we just got back home. I'm sorry I wasn't able to record so much. I, there was just so much for me to learn since it was my first time hanging. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's definitely different from the previous videos I upload, but I hope you still enjoyed it. Um, at least click that like button. Um, if you're feeling a little generous, even subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.